Welcome! In front of me I have Huawei Watch 4 Active and I'm gonna show you how to pair this watch with the Android phone. First thing we need to do, or rather you will need to do, is to turn on the watch. And to turn it on, press and hold the crown button and keep holding it until you see the Huawei logo on the screen. And once you see the logo on the screen, you can release the button and wait until the watch turns on. And after the watch turns on, you may see the list of languages on the screen. Once you see it, scroll through it, find the language you would like to use on your watch, and then tap on the language to select it. And after you select the language, you will need to download and install the uh, Huawei Health application on your phone. And this part is quite tricky because first we need to download the app gallery, Huawei app gallery, and then use the app gallery to download the Huawei Health application. So, make sure you have the internet connection on your phone and Bluetooth enabled. Once you do, open the uh, web browser, could be any browser you want. I'm gonna use Google Chrome. Tap on search and enter this address, appgallery.huawei.com. So enter the address and it should direct you to this site. On this site, uh, tap on the uh, download button in the top left corner. Tap on install app gallery and tap on download. As you can see, file is downloading. Let's wait until it's done. And once the application is done downloading, you can tap on open right here, or if you're using different browser, maybe there's different pop-up somewhere, but you can tap on open to open the app. And if you see this warning message, you need to tap on settings and basically allow the installation of unknown apps from the uh, browser, so from the source. And you, you, as you can see, it opened for Chrome. I'm gonna tap on the switch, allow for to install from this source, and then it was a pop-up you will see the pop-up with the installation, tap on install. And once, the, once it's done installing, you can tap on open to open the app. And after the app gallery opens, uh, you will need to tap on next, agree, allow the permission, and you should see the main page of app gallery. Now, Tap on search and type in uh, Huawei Health. And tap on search. You should see this application right here. Tap on it to select it. Then tap on the install button. And if you see this message, tap on settings. Allow uh, installation from of unknown apps. Then go back to the app gallery. Tap on install again. Once you see this pop-up, tap on the install button. And after the application is done installing, you can tap on the open button to open it. Okay, once the Huawei uh, Health app opens, you will need to select the region. Uh, to do it, tap on here. Scroll through the list of regions, find the one you like to use, and uh, tap on it to select it. My bad. Let's go back to the app. Select the uh, region. For example, United Kingdom. Like this. And then tap on Next. Then tap Next. Agree. Allow or deny the permission. Once you see the health page, tap on Devices. Tap on Add Device. Tap on OK, allow the permission, and the app will look for the nearby devices, and it should detect your uh, Huawei watch, as you can see. Tap on link, and uh, it might ask you to log in into an account. So if you're asked to log in into an account, uh, let's wait until it loads. And here we have it, so we need to log in into an account. If you don't have an account, you can always tap on register and make a new one. I already have one, so I'm gonna tap right here, enter the email address and password. 
Okay, and after you log in, it will redirect you to the health page again, I believe. Oh no, never mind. It will redirect you to this page to add device. Or no, it will basically restart the app, like I said before. And once it does, tap on devices again, tap on add device, uh, wait until it finds your watch, tap on link. Allow ordinary ID permission for phone calls. Tap on pair. Tap on the check mark on the watch. Scroll down. Tap on I have read. And then tap on next. Here tap on next. Here you can agree to some uh, enhanced services or enable some enhanced services if you want to and to do it tap on the box next to the service if you want to enable it i'm just gonna uncheck them and tap next tap on ok for some reason it won't let me oh no it's going further okay it just froze okay and here we can check the box to auto download the update packages if you want to and then you can tap on continue tap on done continue right here we can enable the phone notifications so basically if you want to receive the notifications uh, from your phone on your watch you need to enable them and you need to basically allow some permissions if you don't care you can tap on cancel and then ok to confirm i'm gonna enable them so i'm gonna tap on enable it will redirect me to the notification access. Here we need to tap on Huawei Health, tap on the switch next to allow notification access, tap on allow, and then go back to the app, like this. And now we can turn on or off the notifications. And once you turn them on, you can also enable and disable notifications for specific applications. And once you're done, you can tap on done, tap on OK. Allow all 90 permissions, but if you want to use the notifications you will need to allow the permissions then i'm gonna tap on later tap on ok and cancel and here uh, we should see the huawei watch 4 on the device page which means that the devices are paired together and also if you wake up the screen on your watch you will be see that uh, we have the tutorial on the screen we can go through it and after the tutorial the watch should be ready to use like this okay and that's how you pair this watch with the android phone thank you for watching if you found this video helpful please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video